Here's how to make some sense out of Apple Mail's new inbox features on your iPhone. I'm Chris the CyberGuy. Follow me at CyberGuy.com where my newsletter is free. Now, Apple's new mail categories in iOS 18.2 and later are here to help you take control and make managing your email a lot easier. First, you're going to want to make sure that you're running iOS 18.2 or later. So here's how to check your current iOS version and update it if necessary. Go ahead and open settings on your iPhone. Scroll down and tap on general. Now go ahead and tap on software update. Now, if it shows anything lower than 18.2, you're going to need to update that. Now that you're all set with iOS 18.2 or later, let's dive in on how to use the new mail categorization feature. Open the mail app on your iPhone. Now at the top, you're going to see new categories, primary, transactions, updates, and promotions. Tap on any category to view emails sorted specifically for that section. Now, if you want to see all your emails together, swipe from right to left at the top to reveal the all mail option. Once you update to iOS 18.2 or later, the default will be the categories view. If you tap the three horizontal dots in the top right corner of your inbox, you'll see it is set to categories. If you prefer not to use categories, tap the three horizontal dots again and select list view. I want to make sure my CyberGuy newsletter lands in the primary category. When you first receive my newsletter, be sure to move it to your primary inbox. Scroll through your inbox and locate and tap any email from the CyberGuy newsletter. If you don't have one handy, check your junk or promotions folders, then tap the leftward arrow. Next, click where it says Categorize Sender. Now tap Primary, then Continue. This simple action helps signal its importance. Now, once you manually move an email, like my CyberGuy newsletter, to the primary category, Apple's Mail app is going to learn from this action. It aims to remember this preference for future emails from the same sender. However, there may be instances where the categorization system misclassifies emails, so it's a good idea to check occasionally to see what it's up to. Now, if you find that my CyberGuy newsletter continues to land in a different category, you may need to repeat the action of moving it to the primary until the system adjusts. More helpful hacks like this at CyberGuy.com. If you're not getting my newsletter already, just go to CyberGuy.com on a new browser and click the red button.